Hi, I'm Stephanie Search. I'm from the Council of Neighbors and Organizations. During September, we held our annual Neighbor Up Month. I'd first like to thank our sponsors, um, a and Bank, Hoff and Lee, Diversified Association Management, and AMR for supporting us throughout the month of September. I'd next like to thank our sponsor for the Neighborhood Arts Contest, um, the Cultural Office of the Pikes Peak Region. So we're here today in Thorndale Park um, to present the award to the Organization of West Side Neighbors for their dedication to improving the parks on the west side. So without further ado, it's my pleasure, Sarah Voss and Ellen Goshaw, to present you with the Neighborhood Arts Contest Award. Awesome. Thank you. I'm Susan Davies from the Trails and Open Space Coalition. We are so excited to be part of this project. You know, our Community Engagement Coordinator, Alan Beauchamp, this is his passion to see that these kinds of projects are done. And where it works with us is it's a park, it's improving a park, and most importantly, it's neighbors coming together, taking ownership of a project like this and improving a park. So we're so glad to be part of it. The Cultural Office of the Pikes Peak Region is so pleased to again partner with Kono during Arts Month 2020 for the Neighbor Up Month Art Contest. You know, during Arts Month every year, our community explores how the arts unite, empower, and uh, bring us together around the things that advance our community. And this contest is exactly that. Uh, through the Neighbor Up Month Arts Contest, neighborhoods across the region were able to pitch their creative ideas together and get creative. We hope that you will join us in being creative during Arts October 2020. You can learn more about it at artsoctober.com. The arts function in our community in so many powerful ways. We need the arts more as part of our healing and our recovery than we have for probably a long time in this region. So let's support the arts community. Let's support our neighbors and get out and enjoy Arts Month 2020 this October. Okay, hey, I'm Sarah Voss. I'm the Vice President of the Organization of West Side Neighbors, and we are a nonprofit volunteer neighborhood board for the entire West Side. So last year we had a local resident who was bartending at Front Range Barbecue. I overheard him talking about this basketball court in Kucharis Park and how there were no court lines. Um, and that he was just gonna do it one night in the middle of the night and spray spray paint the grounds. And I said, well, hold on a second. Let me use my resources as uh, a board member for the West Side and called and talked to the city and also to Trails and Space um, Coalition, Trails and Open Space Coalition um, to find out what we could do with this park. So last year we painted the first basketball court with about 20 volunteers. He came up with the design and the colors with the Colorado Sea in the middle. And then from there, uh, it kept going. So we got more neighbors interested and did Blunt Park and then Bot Park. Uh, so this is our fourth park. Behind me here is Thorndale Park, which gets used a lot. So we're here today at Thorndale Park uh, painting the fourth basketball court. So not only are we painting in lines and pretty colors, but we're activating parks that maybe normally wouldn't be used. This park is actually used a lot but Kucharis, Blunt, Bot Park are not used very often. And so it's really great to see neighbors coming out. The city came in and power washed these courts before uh, we came to paint. Um, there's a whole process where we have to prime it and seal it and make sure it's ready for people to play on. Um, we've received a little bit of funding from the city and some really great support from them. We did our own fundraiser through the Trails and Open Space Coalition on Facebook. And then we're really excited about getting this grant through Copper for Arts Month uh, to contribute to this project and then go back and touch up some of those other courts that have since faded uh, from use.